Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, my name is Nick, as always you can call me Touch of Ninja, and we are once again back playing some Uncharted 4, A Thief's End, and we are moving on to Chapter 6 after a very lengthy Episode 1 and start to the series. This chapter is called Once a Thief, and we are going to continue and enjoy the beauty that is... I can't believe I'm out. I can't believe I'm here with you in Italy, huh? <laughs> yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know? Uh, well, now the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh, uh, so this, this isn't your first time here? No, it's more like uh, third. Had a couple of odd jobs. With Sullivan? Well, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I sense a little tiny bit of jealousy. But yeah, we're here to continue our adventure, enjoy the sights and sounds and epicness of Uncharted 4. Maybe once in a while, go off the beaten path and find treasure. Look at that. Okay. Keep it moving. I Man, see. There's no way up under that bridge. I see. Well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Oh, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm watching. I uh. <laughs> I missed. <laughs> uh, see, it's uh, it's all in the wrist. Here, let me see. Ah, see? Yeah, it's not bad. For a second attempt. I'm just a go. little rusty, okay? <laughs> While reaching, it's safe to jump. Why am I jumping up here? There we go. That's better. <laughs> you see that? Oh, like a pro. It's your turn. Drop down. I didn't watch him do it. Okay, so where to next? Took a leap of faith the very first time and it just failed for me, didn't it? Hey, but we can swing off that beam up there. Uh, definitely. Pass me the rope. Hey, let's switch places. All right, climb over me. I've, I've got a good grip. Okay. Come on. Okay, there we go. <laughs> First try. All right, no one likes a show off. Send okay. the rope back Come over. On, it looks like you can uh, climb down and make your way over. Right behind you. <laughs> I was going to try to go for the jump. Good thing you said something there. I was like, I could make that jump. <laughs> Apparently not. Okay. Go. Wall run. No, 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 no. Don't go down. Ah, shit. I need you to go up. Okay, let's go all the way to the top first. Death is inches away. Man, we are trusting our life to an overgrown shrub. I feel very unsafe. Bene. Inghilterra Inghilterra. Traditore. Hey, don't confound the logo of nazionale con la realtà. Okay, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Rena thug was packing some serious heat. Should have brought guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly we won't need them. I hope you're right. Maybe. Uh, all those years. It's the little things that you miss the most. Just maybe. 
We'll run into Ezio. Like what? The smell of fresh citrus. <laughs> uh, riding the motorcycle. It's little things, but they add up. Take this guy out of the game with his grappling hook, Batman style. That should hold. Should? What do you mean, should? Come on. We can make that jump. There you go. All right, come on down. Oh my god, you barely made that. These landings are a little more painful than I remember. Yeah, tell me about it. So, uh, your other wonderful finds, uh, the ones I missed, did you at least take any pictures? Conversation. Where's the conversation? Come back! I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but camera didn't make it. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I can show you. You have drawings? What, are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. I can't wait. I think he's making fun of my drawings. <clears throat> nice, nice. High five, they're nice. Shimmy across. Up we go. Ah, this looks promising. I think you mean precarious. Boy, these bricks are definitely gonna fall out of my hands. I can feel it. Shit! Mm. You okay up there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Almost there. Where go? It'd suck if you missed right now. It sure would. But I don't miss. Send the rope back down. Looks like we put on a couple extra poundage. Don't look as lean and mean as we did in previous games. Hi, thanks. Uh, Nathan? Nathan? What? Oh, yeah. Okay. You all right? Yeah. How do I look? Like 400 million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Yeah, in real life with all that climbing. Sully? You know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. <sighs> you remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamn. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm -hmm. let's, uh, let's try keeping him alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah, uh, about that. What, what about that? Come on, let me show you something. Take a look. That's Avery's cross. They brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Take a whole pile of cash to make that happen. All right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, there's gotta be some way we can grab it. <laughs> there is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, but we just need a diversion. Mike? 
Like, um... Like, I don't know. But there's gotta be something. Well, if the guards see us <laughs> making for that cross... But they don't see us. Hmm? Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for, for lights, lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? There's ventilation. Electrical? That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. And that'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. So there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signora. <clears throat> Antipasti? I'm all set. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Don't you focus? The waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Uh -huh. That will work. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room. Kill the power. You mean I'm the waiter? You're the best pickpocket. What? You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything uh, hinky goes down. Roger that. All right. Listen, we still got this. Ready? Ready. All right, follow me. We'll cut through the cellar. Blackout. That is a much say, better. Through the years have been kind to you. Thanks. I chuck it up to go on vegan. Really? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Hell no. It's much better than my plan was. Ooh. Yoink. My plan was to have Victor fake a heart attack. <laughs> My dad is having a heart attack. My dad is having a heart attack. Excuse me, excuse me. What are you doing? I'm just going over our exit strategy. It's gonna get hairy. <laughs> Look, relax. We pulled up tougher heist than this. Yeah, I know, I know. I just try not to imagine what they'll do if they catch us. Sam, if things go bad, we'll be dead long before they catch us. That's a comforting point. Yeah. Where'd Sully go? Oh, there you are, sir. Okay, you lead the way. We should be encountering another major character in this game. A certain lady. You see, I thought I had a reasonable grasp of French, or at least a possible French accent. Hobbit's final, but midnight night, zero penalties. Starting price two hundred thousand euros. Sell it just through there. Let's go. Yeah, this place is fancy. Of course they play douchey European techno. Pardon me? Drop that beat. I guess so. It's a small detail. See how he walked around? Uh, we didn't walk around a, as a group of Here three. Hey, let's do this. Because that would have been suspicious. So they designed him to go around. That's, it's just those small things, you know? It's the small things. Oh, hell, it's locked. Shit, it was open earlier. Now what? Can we pick it? No, it's electronic. We're gonna have to find another way in. <laughs> I'm gonna so botch this. Oh, real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. Come 
Come on, hold still. Staring at a man's ass here. Come on. So close. Something bad's about to happen. Real bad. Did you stop moving your cheeks? <laughs> and he doubted me. I wonder what happens if I scoot it up. Game over, man. Game over. Pleasure to watch professionals at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. I love his mustache. Hands in the air. <laughs> Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself. Feels so out of place here. Can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. And with the guns Eight. on her. Catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Nadine Ross? Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run in with them. It's putting it mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. You gotta find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. And lure one out of the kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. I wonder if they host weddings. Oh, yeah, they're a full service site. Weddings, bar mitzvahs, black market auctions. But do they have a DJ? This would not be a very practical place for a treasure to be hidden, but you know. It never makes sense anyways. So no harm looking. I probably already passed it. Have a peek. Agente di so crap. You see a waiter in there? Nah, just more heavily armed goons. We're getting our mission impossible. What is this? This gate wasn't on the blueprint. Locked, of course. Okay, plan B. We have a plan B? Dang. There you go. Eh, it's only 2013. It ain't vintage yet. I see some fence up there. Nathan, go check this out. Here we go. Let there be light. Got electrical in this joint. 
Don't suppose you brought a... Yeah, that'll do. I guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. Why do I feel like I'm going to like discover a dead body somewhere? Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. <sighs> That's a lot of really rare vintage. Yeah, maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. <laughs> That's something tells me that's not gonna fly. How about you pass me the light? Hey, uh, she'll be worried that Victor is chatting up Nadine Ross. I mean, heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. Guy can talk his way out of anything. Pass me the flashlight, man. I cannot see a thing in here. Forward or back? There you go. Come back around this way. And the passageway will reveal itself. Uh, this way. Hey, look the vents. That's our way out. Yep, let's find something to climb on. We need a casket. There we go. Yeah, I got it. No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding a lighter. Holding a lighter. Gotta bust a hernia here. Okay, up we go. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? And a lot more dusty. Shh, shh, shh. Damn it. Cosa portiamo a quell'odioso miliardario tedesco? Quello con il parrucchino e quella roba sul naso. There's no shortage of waiters around here. Getting our Batman on. <laughs> Trudging through events. Football. Something's got them antsy. Fresh air, here we come. 